Up late. From Marshall University in Huntington, West Virginia, you're up late with Jamie Lafiego. Tonight's guest from 100.5 WKEE, Dave and Tia. Plus music by Point of Jarris. And now, your host, Jamie Lafiego. It happens. It happens. I was going to shoot it. Decent shot, Kyle. Decent shot. Hello and welcome to the show tonight. Thank you for being here in the studio audience. What a big show we have. Hey, big news from ESPN's Monday Night Football. The network parted ways with Hank Williams Jr. after the singer compared President Obama with Adolf Hitler. It's true. It's, it's not good. When asked for his comment, Hank Williams Jr. said, Whatever happened to freedom of speech? What is this, Nazi Germany? Oh, yeah, I forgot. Hitler, Obama. I forgot I said that. No. Not good. I, wish, I wish, yeah, too soon. I wish we had Aaron in the paints. Anyway, for those of you that didn't see the show last week, and I think that's Kyle. He's got his hand up. That's horrible. We had on Mayor Kim Wolf, and he brought his horse, Mr. Chips, with him. Now, Mr. Chips is part of the Don't Horse Her Around with Drugs program that teaches elementary school children the negative effects on drugs. After the show, Mr. Chips ran into an old friend of his, and it was kind of strange. Oh, hello, Mr. Chips. I thought that was you. Haven't seen you in a while. How's the mayor been? Oh, hello, Mr. Mayor. Uh, what's, your, what's your horse's name? Oh, well, my name is Derek. Derek. I'm a horse. Oh, hello, Mr. Chips. Um, well, I'm glad you teach kids not to horse around with drugs. You know, drugs are bad, but... uh. Can I buy some drugs from you? Did he hear that? You're very quiet, Mr. Chips. Well, I guess I'm going to go get my own drugs. Thanks, Mr. Chips. Wow, that's what we're doing now. That's what puppets. we're doing. We're, we're going to the puppet. That's our new uh, format, puppets. Fart jokes are coming up next. I time. hope so. Bring back Gary. And Kyle, are you doing okay? Is the audience screaming out <laughs> suggestions? I'm doing fine. I'm feeling a little gassy. <laughs> I guess that's what we're doing tonight. That's the level of comedy you're going to get tonight on Out Late. Well, listen, last week on the show, we sent you, Patrick Webb, Tyler Kess, Katie Farrell out on campus to try to get some dates. And you heard about Aaron, right? Yeah. He's not too happy about it. Aaron Payne, our audio operator, says, hey, I want some of that action, so here's Aaron goes according. Hey Marshall Head, I just ID uh, Jason Corey. Can I get a uh, women's softball on the radio for next week? Thanks, you got. Hey, you can get baseball. Well, fine. If that's how you feel, then it's over. Down right now, or down in the dumps, might be sad. I think about cut yourself, but you don't. You don't cut yourself. You know why? Why? Because there are other fish in the sea. You're gonna find somebody that appreciates you, or you. Really? Yes. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Not, not me. Like fat dudes. You're a bit too skinny. Cheer up, somebody will like you. That was just amazing. I think that's that's not right, though. That was right, and Aaron got something confused, but that's okay. It should be carting. Well, you know what? Cart We're not the smartest group of people here tonight. All right. Well, this past week was the annual career fair on Marshall's campus, and every year we go over to the student center to try to shoot something funny, and every year we come back with more candy than comedy. Let's see what happened this year. No, no. You tell Zach Morris I want the pizza. All right, bye. Who's this? Uh, Say by the bell. Hi everyone, I'm TV's Patrick Webb. 
I'm Tyler. I'm his assistant. Okay. All right. And we're here at the Career Expo Fair, and we're going to try and get people to be on our show. Be on television. We got the latest equipment. We got the best out. Stop it. Sit down. Stop that. Step right up. Get it while it's still on TV. Best TV show in the country, right here. We are a talk show, late night uh, comedy you know, type talk show. Uh -huh. You know Conan? Conan right. O'Brien? Well, forget about Conan. Doesn't matter, because we're better than him. Yeah, go ahead and yeah. write your name down for yep. us. But before Take you do that, one. could you do me a favor? Look at this camera right here and yep. do something funny. Not this camera, it's not that plugged camera, in. Right. That no, one right that there. One. Yeah. <laughs> Is that a camera? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's one of the crappy old ones they used to use back in the 60s. Yeah, yeah we get not this kind of not this baby right here. Yeah. This shoots in 3D actually. Yeah. Okay, if there's one thing you could do to wow everyone with how funny you are, you look right in that camera. What would you do? That's pretty funny. Yeah, that's funny. <laughs> this man knows <laughs> Right do you now, think it's weird so. that like once we got in this corner, there seemed to be way less people coming around. I I noticed that Is a little. Like, bit. Hello, sir. Would you like to be on TV? You sure? You look like you, you look could like run you got it on. Like, yeah. Pretty banging news segment. Like a pr political commentator. Yeah. You think you could do a good job? We are yeah. looking for political commentary on Uplay. Yeah. Because that's what people look for when they watch comedy. Could have been the next Bill O'Reilly. Missed his chance. Would you like to be on TV? I'd rather not. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, you <Maybe> are. <laughs> we no Excuse me, ma'am. Would you like to be on the TV? Yeah. Are you sure? <laughs> she said, get a shot of her. I don't know. <laughs> you guys want to be on TV? Would you guys like to be on TV? You sure? Well, well you are. <laughs> Bring me Peter Pan. You can walk into a restaurant and say, hi, my name is, I work for Up Late, and they will say, find this man a table right now. Yeah. It happened to me three times. Three times. <laughs> yeah. You like quick tables? You like Applebee's? It's pretty good. We're not talking like they seat you. They give you the table. Yeah. You know anything about News Channel 3? We're on at 4.30 in the morning. Do well, I know anything about News Channel 3? Mm -hmm. Not much. <laughs> What's the question? We're on at 4.30 in the morning. You should watch us. Yeah. Oh, is that when it's on now? Yeah. Shouldn't we mark 4 30 a.m. Mark on that? Saturdays? It was on right after SNL. Like yeah, that. I know they cut us back. <laughs> Somebody has to watch it all out, all right? <laughs> all right, well, career fair is coming to a close. We replaced Tyler with our friend Cam here because, well, Tyler actually got a job. We didn't expect that. Who knew? We got a list of, um, like seven names that we're not going to use and one resume that we're probably going to write funny pictures on. You know, unicorns, horses. <laughs> funny stuff that throw it in there. But all in all, a pretty successful day. Absolutely. Free waters. And popcorn. I love popcorn. Popcorn was good. <laughs> well, popcorn Cam. was good. That was the career fair. And again, more candy, less comedy. But more TV's Patrick Webb. He's always on TV. <laughs> Stay with us after the break from 100.5 WKE. Dave and T will be here. We'll be right back.